Let's go, Windows logo. Round one. That's just a bot. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Alright, sorry about that. We were just getting everything yeah, all set up for it. Land that counter attack on wake up. <laughs> Alright, so nice uh, Thunderbolt. Alright. Coach is playing solid, just trying to play neutral. Just trying to feel just trying to feel game out right now, probably. Alright, you got first already because it's Pika. And he's got Mew, he's got crits. It's gonna make. No, crits is actually. Oh, oh that was a good reaction. That was a good reaction. That was a good round. Crits is actually really, really good for Pika because it makes a couple of his moves really good. It makes his. First off, it makes his 2i a little bit more hit confirmable. Uh, it's able to be hit confirmed out of crit, but it makes it a little bit easier. Not really look for it as much. Uh, his sounds a little weird. Uh, but. It really makes his 8x super strong. It makes that launch all the time. And that's a really good move. It goes with like uh, low crushes on uh, really early into the startup. Right. And it uh, and it's a mid. Or it's a mid high. It's, it's a really good move, especially if they crits and it launches all the time. Lots of it. And he's already got burst once again. Yep, it's Pikachu. I gotta wonder when the Umbreon is gonna pop. Yeah. It doesn't seem like Gamble. I don't think Gamble's easy. Yeah. Eat. There we go. Just gonna use it to keep up a little bit of pressure. Oh, and Co Coach is gonna let him get away with that sucker punch. Okay. Probably hasn't practiced punish. Oh, and he's gonna punish. He's gonna get punished for doing that cross up. Gamble feeling it. This is gonna be a momentum shift for sure. He still has Mew on deck. No, but he's not gonna get to use it. Right. This is Dry being able to walk you out of that support. And that was a very solid burst. Yeah, good reaction from Coach. He's like, none of this fake stuff. None of this fake Oki. None of this. This isn't real pressure. I'm going to burst right through it. Going to get a punish. Oh, that Sucker Punch. No autocorrect from Sucker Punch. But Coach doesn't really seem to be accustomed to punishing Sucker Punch. So Gamble should take note of that and, like, you know, use it. If you can't punish it, why not? This is not quite going to kill. Yeah, but he's going he's gonna to use Muse to get, put him in a good reset situation. And that's going to be it. Yep. That would be round one to Coach Steve. Very solid. Very solid stuff. Now, do we know if Gamble has any other characters or if he's only a Decidueye? No idea. Doesn't. At the Just very least, for this matchup, doesn't look like it. I'm not sure how Decidueye does in this matchup. I would assume he at least does. Like, it's. I would assume even it's a leap even, yeah, yeah. But, like, you know, I have no idea. Uh, Rising JY. He can't do that versus Pikachu because uh, Pikachu's so small. So I'm wondering, like, how practical it, or like how much harder it is for him to hit it on small characters like Pikachu, and if that makes or just impress not even just Rising Joy, like his pressure in general. Like, I don't know how well it works on Pikachu. So, and I don't see him doing a lot of like pressure to Pikachu. So I'm wondering if that's why maybe. Uh, that is possible. Um, that was almost the sickest anti of all time. <laughs> that was oh. almost the sickest pucker, sucker punch of all time. All right, let's hope he can connect some of these sick moves. All right, good back, or right, good side dash. That was good knowledge. He's gonna get grabbed anyways. <laughs> get off of me! Oh, drops the combo. That was, that was gonna be big damage. This is also gonna be big, big damage. And that's the counter attack on wake up. Is it gonna break it? Yep. But Coach Steve is willing to take that. He's he's willing to give up that damn that little bit of health for the meter. But now he's in a really bad spot. Now he uh, now he has, he has to. to oh, it. never mind. That's what you get for talking. <laughs> that was that was good awareness from Coach Steve. He was like, "This this Oki is gonna work on me for sure. I'm gonna wake up grab, which is generally a really risky option. But if you know what's going on, like if you if you can see what's going on on the screen, and you be like, this is not gonna hit me, and you're gonna be punishable, you can get a punish. He's like, I don't need to burst it. And this is gonna. Oh, oh no, no! It looks like he dropped the combo. So this is extremely close. Oh, okay. Mind. Just gonna get hit by a, a straight thunder jolt. That's thunder jolt, right? That's what they. I'm pretty sure that's thunder jolt. Uh, what, what uh, and that is punishable. Coach gonna get a punish. Yeah, I'm over a little bit there. Interesting. Using two extra approach. 
good reaction, good block. Just just poking the counter and blocking. He doesn't want to try to overextend and try and punish it. Try and hit him out of the counter. He's like, I'm just going to block because I know this counter is really good. <laughs> Looks like I'm actually up. Yep. I will be maybe Good luck. back. Thank you. Coach Steve just has, seems to have a really good under. That was such a good dodge. I don't know if he intentionally dodged that ADEX, but that was really clean. Uh, that was really clean looking. Uh, but yeah, Coach is just playing really solid. He's just playing solid neutral. Uh, and it seems like he knows his spacing for this matchup. Oh, yeah. See, look, look at that. That was so good. Nice confirm. And Coach Coach's going to take it 2 0 over Coach Steve. Oh, oh, the scores weren't being updated. Yeah, I was going to say, that was game two? Yeah. Okay, cool. Also, what's up, Utah? Also, what's up? 